Hello friends, my name is Srinivas and welcome to my channel Tech Studio 82. Please visit our website at www.techstudio82.com. Before watching this video, please subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to press bell icon for latest updates. In this video, I will show you how to download and install Oracle Database 11G Express Edition software on Windows 10. And also we will do configuration with the help of SQL Developer which is a standalone software. As a prerequisites, you should have a good internet connection and also your PC should be installed with the WinRAR software for extracting the downloaded software. This we will do step by step. First, we will download the software. Secondly, we will install the downloaded software. And finally, we will do configuration with the help of SQL Developer, which is a standalone software. So let's get started with the first step that is download. In this step, we will visit Oracle official website and we will download the Oracle 11G Database Express Edition software directly from the Oracle websites itself. Open any web browser and in the URL, please type the link as you are seeing on the screen or in the below description I have given the same link and just click on that link it will direct to the official website see this is the Oracle official website from here we are going to download Oracle database 11G Express Edition for Windows 64 bit why I have given this direct link in the Oracle website you if you want to download this software by searching the software also you will be very tedious it will be very tedious task for you so I have directly given this link in the below description part. So, so just click on that link. It will direct to this archive folder. Since I am using Windows 10, which is 64 bit version, I am going to download Windows 64 bit version. And this is for 32 bit and this is for Linux 64 bit. So I am going to download this. By just clicking on this, you must accept the Oracle license agreement to download this software. Just click on this and you will be redirected to the login screen in order to download the file okay just click on this now you are in the oracle account login page you need to have an oracle account in order to download any software from the oracle web official website so if you don't have an account just create an account trust me creating an oracle account is as simple as creating a gmail account okay for future purpose also, if you want to download any software from the Oracle website, just create an Oracle account. I'm already having an Oracle account. So I'm just giving my credentials. So I have given the Oracle account credentials. Just signing in. Now my download will get started. Just have some patience. See here you can see Oracle Express Edition 11G Windows 64 bit, which is 317 MB. Okay. Just clicking on show all. Here you can see it all depends upon your bandwidth. We are currently downloading Oracle 11G Windows 64 bit version. Well, the size of the software is 317 MB. It all depends upon your internet bandwidth. You can see the current progress. Finally, I have successfully downloaded the software. Just click on the show in folder. It will direct to the downloads folder. See, this is my downloads folder. Here I have successfully downloaded the Oracle Express Edition 11G, which is Windows 64 bit version software. Okay. In this way, you can download the Oracle 11G software from the Oracle website. If you don't have an Oracle account, then no issues. I have uploaded the same software in that Google Drives. In the below description, you can see the alternative link. Just click on that link. You can directly download without Oracle account or any login credential. Okay, just click on that. Just please check the below description part. So far, we have successfully downloaded the software. Now let's move on to the second step that is installation part. In order to install this software, first we need to extract this zip file. So right click, extract here, extraction is in progress, file got extracted, this is the final file, double click. So this is the three files, we need to click on the setup file, just right click, run as administrator. Whenever you are installing any software, it's always recommended that you run as administrator. Just click on the run as administrator. See, you can see the setup is in progress. You can see on the screen Oracle Database 11G Express Edition install wizard. Welcome to the installation wizard for Oracle. Okay, just click on next. Now we need to accept the license agreement. Accept. Click on next. You need to choose the destination location. By default, it will be C. So let it be in the C only. If you want to change the 
path then you can change by browsing so right now i don't want to uh, change the location let it be the default one click on next in the next step we need to specify the database passwords this database password is for the sys and for the system database accounts so enter the password i'm giving as admin please remember the password because at the time of configuration we need this password and confirm the password repeat the password same as admin and click on the next in this step you can see the summary you need to review settings before proceeding with the installation so this is the current installation settings this is the destination folder and the for the port all these things and uh, just click on the install and finally the installation wizard is installing oracle database 11g express edition you can see the progress installation will take hardly one or two minutes it all depends upon your uh, system configurations please have some patience on the desktop you can see xe shortcut has been created now it is creating and starting services for oracle database 11g express edition right now it is configuring database finally we have successfully finished the setup installing oracle database 11g express edition on our pc okay click on finish let's verify the software click on the start menu here you can see recently added but we will verify by scrolling down oracle database 11g express edition this is you can see new just drop down here you can see click on the run sql command line on the screen you can see run sql command line prompt so this means we have successfully installed the oracle database 11g express edition on on our pc so far we have successfully downloaded the software and installed the oracle database 11g express edition on our pc let's move on to the final step that is the configuration part in the final configuration setup first we will download oracle sql developer software which is a standalone software later we will configure the database connections in sql developer and finally we will unlock hr schema and scott scheme okay then let's download the oracle sql developer software open google in any web browser and search with the keyword sql developer download this is the one just click on this here you can see oracle sql developer downloads the first one just click on the first link it will direct to the official website this is the oracle official website from here you can download the sql developer which is the latest version 21.4.2 i am i am downloading for the 64 bit with jdk 8 included the size of this file is 436 mb just click on this download you must accept the oracle license agreement just click on the oracle license agreement you will be redirected to the login screen in order to download the file just click on the download button you need to give in the login credentials i have given my oracle login credentials just click on sign in here you can see your download got started which is 436 mb just click on the show all here you can see the download status it all depends upon your internet bandwidth connection finally i have downloaded the sql developer software which is a standalone software just click on the show in folder it will direct to the downloads folder this is my downloads folder this is the one right click and click on extract to sql developer your extraction is in progress file got extracted double click on this folder here you can see sql developer icon which is the application icon this one just right click and open your pc will throw a pop up but no issues install anyway click on install anyway here you can see it is loading this is a standalone software it will give a pop up just click on no on the screen you can see oracle sql developer welcome page just click on this pop up window okay first we need to create oracle database connection just click on this plus icon this is a new connection just click on this here you can see new or select database connection first we need to create a database connection for the system this is for the system and we need to give username and password username is for the system and the password at the time of configuration we have given as admin so i am providing i am giving as admin and let it the default one just click on test connection here you can see the status as success click on connect so we have successfully created system connection here you can see here i am going to unlock the hr schema unlock just execute this here you can see user hr altered now we are going to create one more connection for hr schema just click on new connection here give name as hr and username as hr and password as hr only hr let it is the default connection and click on test connection here you can see the status success click on connect 
now we have successfully connected to the hr schema also let's browse select star from tab execute here you can see all the tables that is in a hr schema in this way we can unlock hr schema so far we have downloaded the oracle database 11g express edition software and we have successfully installed in our pc and finally we have done configuration by using sql developer and also we have unlocked the hr schema for our practice purpose thanks for watching if you like my video please subscribe to my channel and also don't forget to press bell icon for latest updates please like and also share my videos with your friends and drop a comment your comments are highly valuable thank you